Imagine a cosmic lighthouse beaming signals across the universe, but with a twist. It flashes only once every 6.5 hours. This is a real newly discovered celestial object named ASCAP J1839-0756. It challenges our fundamental understanding of neutron stars and pulsars, pushing the boundaries of modern astrophysics. In this video, we'll explain the discovery of this mysterious object, explore why it defies existing scientific paradigms, and discuss the implications it holds for our understanding of the cosmos. Astronomers are constantly scanning the sky for unusual cosmic phenomena that could unlock new secrets of the universe. In January 2025, researchers using the Australian Square Kilometer Array Pathfinder made an extraordinary discovery, a radio source unlike anything observed before. While conducting routine surveys of the sky, they detected an unusual repeating signal from a celestial object located within our Milky Way galaxy. What made this interesting was the extremely slow repetition rate. The signal appeared once every 6.45 hours. Compared to the typical pulsars that rotate multiple times per second, this was an anomaly of staggering proportions. ASCAP first appeared as a bright radio burst that rapidly faded within 15 minutes decreasing in brightness by an astonishing 95%. This abrupt drop in signal strength was unexpected because most known pulsars and neutron stars produce relatively stable emissions. The source, which had no prior records in astronomical catalogs, immediately caught the attention of astronomers who sought to understand its nature. Following the initial detection, Astronomers conducted follow-up observations using multiple radio telescopes worldwide, including Meerkat in South Africa, CSIRO's Australia Telescope Compact Array, and the Murchison Wide Field Array. Each of these telescopes confirmed that this object emitted periodic pulses with an extremely slow rotation rate, far beyond what was expected for an active neutron star. This object doesn't just emit a single pulse per rotation, it emits two pulses per cycle. The second pulse, called an interpulse, occurs roughly 3.2 hours after the main pulse. This suggests the object emits radio waves from both its magnetic poles, a feature typically seen in pulsars whose magnetic axes are nearly perpendicular to their rotational axes. The presence of interpulses suggests that the object's magnetic field geometry is highly unusual possibly different from anything seen before in neutron stars. The object's radio waves exhibit strong polarization, meaning that the light waves are aligned in a particular direction. This polarization suggests that the radiation originates from an environment with an extremely intense magnetic field, similar to those found in neutron stars and magnetars. Additionally, by analyzing the dispersion measure, the delay of the signal as it travels through interstellar space. Scientists estimated that the object is located approximately 4,000 light years away. Neutron stars, the ultra dense remnants of massive stars that have undergone supernova explosions, typically rotate at extreme speeds. The majority of known pulsars rotate several times per second with some extreme cases, known as millisecond pulsars, spinning at over 700 times per second. According to current theoretical models, neutron stars should slow down gradually as they lose energy through electromagnetic radiation. However, once their rotation period exceeds a few minutes, they are expected to become radio silent due to insufficient energy to sustain their emissions. ASCAP completely defies this expectation. Despite rotating once every 6.45 hours, it continues to emit strong radio waves, an impossible feat according to current astrophysical theories. One of the key mysteries is how this object is still able to produce radio emissions despite its sluggish rotation. Several hypotheses have been proposed, but none perfectly explain its behavior. The first possibility is that it could be a rotationally powered pulsar, 
where the energy for its emissions comes from its rotational speed. However, with such a long rotation period, the available energy should be too weak to sustain its emissions. Another theory suggests that this object might be a magnetar, a type of neutron star with an extremely powerful magnetic field, thousands of times stronger than a typical pulsar. If neutron stars can maintain radio emissions at such slow rotations, it means that there may be many more long-period neutron stars that have simply remained undetected due to their atypical behavior. One of the most intriguing possibilities is that this object could help us understand fast radio bursts, mysterious high-energy radio signals that originate from distant galaxies. Some scientists believe that magnetars could be responsible for certain FRBs, and if this object is indeed a magnetar, it could provide a missing link between these enigmatic bursts and their sources. Interestingly, we've seen a similar challenge to pulsar models before. In 2021, astronomers discovered Gleam X, a highly magnetized neutron star that emitted radio pulses every 18 minutes, which was considered nearly impossible at the time. Gleam X was the first confirmed ultra-long period neutron star, leading scientists to wonder if there were many more out there waiting to be discovered. The discovery of ASCAP now extends that record to 6.45 hours, further proving that the traditional models of neutron star evolution need revision. Future studies with the Square Kilometer Array, the next generation global radio telescope, will be crucial in identifying more objects like ASCAP. The SKA will be 100 times more sensitive than this object, enabling us to detect even longer period neutron stars and refine our models. Astronomers are also planning to conduct multi-wavelength observations using X-ray and gamma-ray telescopes to determine whether ASCAP emits other forms of radiation. If X-rays are detected, it could confirm the magnetar hypothesis. If not, it could indicate the presence of an entirely new type of neutron star. The most exciting part? We are only scratching the surface. This object is likely just the first of many undiscovered long-period neutron stars, and future surveys may reveal an entirely new population of slow-spinning, radio-emitting objects that could reshape astrophysics forever. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the mysteries of the universe, don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more cosmic discoveries.